Every week, 4,000 Britons are hospitalised through DIY accidents. Is that true or false? I've never met anyone who's been involved in a DIY accident or even heard a story about someone who's been involved in a DIY accident. Yeah, but then you move in the right circles to hear the <laughs> DIY stories. <laughs> I've, I've built stuff. Yeah? What have you built? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> God, that's the woman who marries you. Why? Because you don't... What do you do, then? I'm an what? attractive prospect, Tricia. <laughs> Are you good around the house, Emma? No, my light bulb burns out. I sell the house and move. <laughs> I bet Dave does DIY. You look kind of a no, DIY. No, I don't, and I think oh. that's probably, you know, people do get hospitalised because sh men are generally shit at DIY. The ones who are good at DIY do it for a living, basically. Why are men on this planet? If you All cannot right, put Trisha, out the rubbish okay. into DIY, okay. why are you here? Bridges, roads, <laughs> hospitals, everything you can think of that's <laughs> ever been invented. <laughs> Western civilization, yes. in short. But, Sean, if we don't give you a little bit of how's your father, never mind about building... How's your father? <laughs> How is it way back there in the 50s? <laughs> I tried to be polite on the television. All right, Have you seen we... your show? <laughs> <laughs> never mind building civilizations. You can't last two days without a bit of Listen, sex. you shelf hooer. <laughs> You're putting out... Is your, is your house just covered in shelves? Yeah. <laughs> going, it's brilliant. Every time I put one out, no, she puts up. He can, <laughs> he, can, he, he can do a bit of deal. deal can he? Yeah. I bet his shed's fantastic. <laughs> his shed is great. He's got an amazing shed in the garden. <laughs> yeah. With a combination lock on there, a drawbridge, everything. <laughs> <laughs> in the shed, he's got a gun turret. <laughs> <laughs> oh! I'm in the shed! <laughs> Yeah, just stuff! <laughs> <laughs> OK, so every week, 4,000 Brits are hospitalised through DIY accidents. Is that true or false? I think it's an absolute scandal, that statement. It's foul calumny. <laughs> it's absolute nonsense. Poppycock. Absolute balderdash. What are you saying? Just give me an answer. No. You're saying no? You're saying it's false? Yeah. Yeah, I'm saying it's false. I can tell you that the answer is, in fact, true. Yeah. Oh. 4,000 Brits are hospitalised each week through DIY accidents. I once had a serious DIY accident. The phone rang while I was using a nail gun. <laughs> <laughs> OK, Dave, Tricia and Justin, let's have a look at a clip to illustrate your statistic. <laughs> what the hell? I'll take care of this. Look, buddy, I don't know who you are, but I'm going to kick your ass. What are you doing with my wife? What? I'm not your wife, mister. Shut up, Anna. Well, that's it, man. <laughs> <laughs> Best episode of Lovejoy ever. <laughs> Here is your related statistic. 64% of men believe they have a higher pain <laughs> threshold than women. Is that true or false? You don't get colds, do you? You get the flu. Yeah, well, that's not pain, is it? Pain's like getting your d*** caught in your flies. That's <laughs> real pain. No, real pain is giving birth. It's like, as Diana well, Ross once told me, it's like sh in a fridge. <laughs> I read in Cosmopolitan, I've seen some doctor's surgery, it said the, the thing, the most painful thing that a woman can have done is have the nipples clamped. And I thought, well, no, I mean, having them torn away has got to be worse. <laughs> <laughs> but I think, actually, having said all that, women do have a higher pain threshold, cos they go through all sorts of yeah, stuff well, just, to, just to feel and look good. It is all painful stuff you put yourself through just to attract, well, just to look good and feel good, and for us... It, you were going to say attract men, well, weren't you? Well, in you a way, yeah, in a way. But, I mean, there's a bloke in Lee this week got arrested for shagging a frozen turkey, so, you know what I mean? It's like... <laughs> <laughs> So we're wasting our time, is well, that what you're you know. saying? Trisha, you're in a really bad mood tonight, aren't you? Well, just <laughs> question everything. Cos I'm the only girl here... No, I'm not. Alex is the other girl. <laughs> Do you have a pop at our little Alex? No, Alex is more of a girl than I am. He's, he's all sweet. Why would you say I was a girl? But you're sort of all, you know... Oh, I don't... I can't... <laughs> is that your impression of me? You're sort of... Are you sitting there doing an impression of me? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sitting there doing a... No, you're all sort of delicate. I can be fairly rugged. <laughs> Go on, then. Go ahead. Oh, Go, on. Go ahead, let's have yeah? some ruggedness. Yeah, yeah. let's oh, see rugged. So, anyway, I was watching the football. Uh, uh. Yeah? yeah? 
I don't know I can pull it off. <laughs> really? Yeah, just push me. Just, just a push. Hang on. Uh, yeah! <laughs> Oh, my hero. Shut up, Trisha! Yeah.